once you talk with Sebastian, he'll give you a side quest and it will unlock the dueling quest. And in that one, there's like three rounds. And the final one is the champion. It's so unfair. They always have shields all the time. You don't. So that's like the unfair part. But that's like the part of the main game. But there's also four of them <laughs> against your two. And the thing is that sometimes they spawn behind you. And it is a waste of time. I just take the L when that happens. So I did this in the beginning. I've been exploring a lot. So I'm actually kind of like high level. But they do scale to you. So it's not like it matters. And so I was like level 6 quest, so I only got like Espeliarmus, Levioso, Asio, and Incendiendo, and you know, Disillusionment, Reparo, you know, all that other stuff, Lumos, uh, Revelio, the, the basic stuff. So I was just fighting it with my beginning spells. And here are some tips to help you guys to beat it. Uh, you maybe do it later in the game, it will still help you. So number one is you should bring a partner and use your teammate as the body shield. They can tank the hits. I don't think they actually lose in this match. So <laughs> just have them take all the hits. You can stand behind them in the in between. But you got to be careful because when they like levitate or whatever, it still can hit you. Um, and then there's some, some of them attack three times. So sometimes you got to be careful. You might have to dodge and stuff. Um, secondly, you can use the objects in the room. They're like, I think there's like four around in like the corners. So you might have to like reposition your camera and yourself to get in range. Uh, oh, we finally did it. Oh my God. 4v2, sometimes they spawn behind you. This is so lame. 